I hope you all are doing so well. Today I am back with Nana. I'm back with Nana. <laughs> and we are going to be filming a sister tag yeah. because we are just so thankful for you guys and for all the support you've given us in, um, in the video with our short hair and just all the people subscribing to my channel. You guys are so awesome and I just feel so blessed. So we compiled a list of questions um, all about ourselves and what we do together and who we are and we're gonna read those off for you guys. So the first question is how old are you both? I am 16 and I am 19. Yes, we are not the same age. We are no. not twins. <laughs> We are three years <laughs> apart and I'm older! <laughs> Question number two is describe each other in one word. So, my word for you <laughs> was free. Free! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that, that's easy. Okay, I had a really hard time finding, I don't know, I had a really hard time knowing what to say for Emma, but I think the one I came out with is well-rounded. Guess each other's most embarrassing moment. <laughs> okay, so uh, I know yours because I was there. <laughs> I was actually photographing her, and actually, this particular shoot was on YouTube. So it is on YouTube. It, it is on YouTube. <laughs> so this shoot was our um, was on my fashion photography tips and stuff, and she was it was when she was my model. So. I styled her and everything, and I didn't have her like wear any like bra underneath or like tank top. It was just a sweater. And there was a guy filming, a friend of ours, who was filming that video of me and her in it. And I go, Emma, I've got this amazing idea for a shoot. What if you jump and throw your arms up at the same time? So he's over here on the side filming. And she goes, jump, and her entire <laughs> shirt comes up, everything exposed. And this poor guy is like traumatized. So is Emma, of course. Like, Emma is mostly traumatized. But I go over and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. And they were trying to play it off like cool, like, oh, it's no big deal. But it was like, like it's, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. <laughs> it's not okay. So we sent him home right after that. I took his camera, deleted Ooh. the deleted the footage from that and I'm like okay bye you gotta go gotta go we haven't seen him since then <laughs> so your embarrassing moment was we were at a church visiting and we were walking back from our seats um, and there were a lot of people around like like tons of people tons of around people. Uh, we're walking this past this particular group of like college-aged people, I guess, and right then, Aaron, okay, so Erin earlier that day had, was wearing a skirt, and she's like, Emma, do you think it's okay if I wear a thong under, and I was like, yeah, it's fine, you're not, just be careful, she's like, okay, so we are walking past this particular group of people, and right then, she walks over a vent, and her skirt goes, Woo! <laughs> like straight up, okay? Not even Marilyn Monroe. Like Marilyn Monroe times ten. What is your dream job? So are you guessing each other's dream job? I okay. So. Well, we kind of know everything about each other, so yeah. So your dream job is to Okay, there's I think there's multiple. <laughs> um one of them I think is to be a photographer for like a magazine or like urban outfitters or free people or something like that. And another dream is probably to just be a famous YouTuber. Right? Full time. Full time YouTuber. I don't want to be famous. Not famous, but like as, that, as your job. Yeah. Emma's, okay, she also has a couple dreams, but I think the one that she wants the most, I can just see it in her eyes every time she talks about it, is to be a pastry chef. Um, and I think she'd be so darn good at it. She makes the best freaking carrot cake you will ever eat. So. Right. Yeah. <laughs> She's our family baker. Yeah. I want to open my own bakery and slash maybe like bookshop. Oh. And then have yeah. Yeah. That's just you in a nutshell. Yeah. <laughs> What's something that annoys you about the other person? Okay. So. Um, okay. So there's like a there's like a temporary annoyance, and then there's like an annoyance that's like okay, like I'm kind of annoyed for like a long time. 
temporary annoyance is when she just goes into my room and takes my clothes. And that happens really often, okay? <laughs> really often. And then like, and then like a more, I don't know, like longer term annoyance is like, She'll be hanging out with like a lot of guys, not in the not in like a woo, I'm pimping as a girl sort of thing, but like she'll be like she's like a lot of guy friends, and then she kind of turns into one of them. <laughs> but then once they go away, it's like oh, it's so nice to have Emma back again. So the thing that annoys me about you is when okay, so she'll just assume that I've taken something or like done something with her stuff, and then yell at me for it. Like she was gone in California and she let me borrow her record player. She comes back and she's like, My record is warped! Emma, what did you do? And I didn't I didn't do it. She was just missing a part of her record player. Yeah. If you could go anywhere in the world together, where would it be and why? Oh. I would have to say we would probably go to the UK. It's been a place we wanted to go to for a long time and like our ancestors just recently came to America from Britain. Yeah. Um, so we like, I guess we really like the British lifestyle, kind of sometimes more than American lifestyle I think. Very true. So the next question is, favorite inside <laughs> joke? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> to people that look on at us, they're like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> so this is because if you guys have ever seen the movie um, Leap Year, <laughs> basically the main character, Amy Adams, is talking about how she is going to Ireland to propose for, to her boyfriend on Leap Day. And he just thinks that's so dumb, so he goes, <laughs> woo! <laughs> well, she goes, it's just woo! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you have to see it. You should go watch it's, it. Yeah, you have to see it. <laughs> okay. What are your pet peeves? I think we're gonna like guess each other's. Yeah. I know Emma's for certain because I was just eating an apple pie like two minutes ago and she looks at me and I say sorry because I was <laughs> smacking my mouth. And so she gross. hates smacking up so especially with their mouth open or smacking their lips, or they go after they finish chewing a bite. <laughs> chewing a bite. <laughs> okay, I have to guess your pet peeves because I don't yeah. I don't really know. I think okay. I think when people are just being dumb mm -hmm. and they don't think, like just now, we were sitting in the car <laughs> and this guy in front of us is facing our car and has his headlights on, but he's just sitting there, he, his car isn't on, and Aaron's yelling at him from the car, turn your freaking headlights off! <laughs> I can't hear her, but she was like about to go over to him and like, yeah, I would not shut up about it. It's was like, so annoying, like, and, and, and when you're like in a movie theater and people are talking, <gasps> or like, or oh their, gosh, I could murder someone, or opening their, their rappers, oh gosh, that just rubs me the wrong yeah. way every single time. The next question is, what are your biggest fears? Erin's biggest fear is being alone. I actually will come in and like, be crying and be like, Emma, tell me I'm going to get married someday. She literally did that the other day. Emma, I don't feel like I'm going to get married. <laughs> it's a fear. I don't feel like I'm going to find a guy. I'm like, Erin, you will. <laughs> come on. For Emma, also, like, I also think, like, yeah, just being alone. Yeah, but it's kind of like in a different way, like not so much just like not having people around and stuff, but we'll always be here for each other. Heels or flats? So for you, I don't know. You know, you know. Heels? Yes. Definitely heels, not like clappy, like pointy-toed um, high heels, like pumps, but I like being taller than I actually am. Yeah, she likes being tall. I don't mind being short. Yeah. We're both really, pr not really short, pretty short. Yeah. I don't mind it, but Erin likes being tall, so. Um, she's more empowered that way. But you're definitely flats. I don't think I've ever, or maybe one time I've worn yes. heels, yeah. but it's just because I can't walk it. I don't ever see her wearing heels I, ever. I wore them to homecoming. Literally, I walked in to the homecoming and then took them off for the rest of the night. And that's all. <laughs> I actually did that too. Do you ever argue? Yes. Not as much as we used yeah. to, but uh, yes. 
Yes, it's all about clothes. Yeah, it's only about clothes. What is your favorite memory together? We've got a lot. We have a lot of really, really good memories together. Yeah. But I would definitely say that um, the times we spend in Cannon Beach, Oregon, are like the best because we go with our family and then our policy there, family policy, is we all just like ditch our phones. And we'll go like biking. We took beach cruisers around town and just like stopped at different stores yeah. and parked our beach cruisers and like going. We try to do something new each year. I think this year when we go, I think we should really go surfing, honestly. That would be so fun. Guess each other's favorite band. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so I know yours. Um, the Beatles. And Edward Sharp and yes. the Magnetic Zeros. But definitely the Beatles is like number Beatles, one. Beatles, yeah. And then for you, also Beatles. Uh -huh. And uh, I don't know, you've been listening to a lot of Kanye West lately. <laughs> so. But I also yeah. like Edward Sharp a yeah. lot. And um, we've got like pretty much the same music style. Yeah, we both like, like yeah. Cage the Elephant. Mm -hmm. We listen to a lot of different bands, so it's a not like we have. It. Yeah. We also like classical music too. Like and jazz, jazz music. Mm. Like um, Louis Armstrong. Oh, so good. Frank Sinatra. Yeah. Okay, action, adventure, comedy, or chick flick for each other, I guess. Yeah. For our favorite movies. Mm -hmm. You are an action adventure person. Definitely. I think maybe all of those to some degree, but mostly action adventure. We don't yeah. really like comedy that yeah, much. Yeah, we're not much of a comedy person. Like, I, I think our favorite, favorite, favorite comedy is. Um, is uh, uh, the other woman? Yes. Oh my god. The goodness. other woman. We <laughs> love the other woman. I hate horror movies. Hate. She hates horror movies. I don't even know why people like. That. I saw the visit and I was like, no. Oh my god. Like with the grandparents. Oh, it's no. awful. And it's Sidious. We both watched that. Oh world. my gosh. Had nightmares <laughs> for three years. Three she years. She thought that the shadows in her corners of her pants or dresses. Pants. <laughs> I hate wearing dresses. We don't wear a lot of dresses. Exhibit A, dress. Flying up. I, I don't do that. I don't do dresses. Okay, last one. All right, the last question is, what is the best thing about one another? Don't start. Yes. Uh, I'll start. Okay, the absolute best thing about Emma, and I'm trying not to tear up. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> um, no, seriously, the the very very best thing about Emma is that she has like probably the the kindest, most generous heart of anyone that I have ever met, and she's just like just a really all around amazing person for that reason. And just I don't know, she just loves and doesn't stop loving. Erin, okay, I was thinking about this. There's a lot of things, <laughs> but to sum it all together, she's a very loyal person. And I guess that can sometimes be a curse in disguise for her, but the thing, like she's always there for you, always. And she's so loving. Yeah. <sighs> That's that. <laughs> that is it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you later. Bye. Peace. <laughs> Remember when people used to do that? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs>